Is it the right time to buy or sell advanced micro devices stock? Today, we'll be taking a deep dive into advanced micro devices. Our initial report was published on our website on Monday, December 4, 2023, and now we're here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Make sure to subscribe, hit the like button, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. It's important not to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Take your trading decisions to the next level with our newly launched AI stock analysis tool powered by GPT-4 at stockinvest.us. Tap into the power of AI and receive free price predictions and in-depth analysis for any of the 25,000 companies worldwide. Please keep in mind that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. As of November 1, 2023, our system has identified advanced micro devices as a promising investment opportunity, giving it a score of 1.61. Now, let's dive into the stock's performance during this period. The stock has experienced a significant gain of 9.75%. This means that on average, it has delivered a daily return of 0.42% since our recommendation to buy. The stock is currently in the midst of a strong upward trend, indicating the potential for further growth. Over the next three months, the trend suggests a possible change of 19.07%, with a potential return ranging from 2.35% to 25.33%. Looking ahead to the next 12 months, the trend predicts a potential change of 45.42%, with a possible return between 20.94% and 86.66%. This could result in a price range of $143.40 to $221.32 after a year. Our latest update on advanced micro devices reveals a concerning headline, red day on Monday for advanced micro devices stock after a decline of 2.32%. On Monday, December 4, 2023, the stock price of advanced micro devices dropped by 2.32%, falling from $121.39 to $118.57. Throughout the trading day, the stock experienced a 3.03% fluctuation, reaching a low of $116.37 and a high of $119.90. Over the past two weeks, there has been a loss of 1.7%. Although volume increased by 4 million shares on the last day, the prices continued to fall. This could be seen as an early warning sign, indicating a slight increase in risk over the next few days. In total, approximately 40 million shares were bought and sold, amounting to $4.72 billion. Looking at the past 52 weeks, the highest price of the stock was $132.82, while the lowest price was $60.05. Currently, the stock price is 10.73%, or $14.25, below the 52-week high. Additionally, it is 27.9%, or $45.89, below the all-time high reached on November 30, 2021, when the price peaked at $164.46. Today, we'll be discussing the latest analyst ratings for AMD. Starting with Monday, November 13, 2023, Citigroup gave AMD a buy grade with a hold action. Moving on to Wednesday, November 1, 2023, Morgan Stanley rated AMD as overweight with a hold action. On the same day, Bernstein gave AMD a market perform grade with a hold action. Also on Wednesday, November 1, 2023, Raymond James rated AMD as overweight with a hold action. Lastly, on Monday, October 30, 2023, KeyBank rated AMD as overweight with a hold action. Analysts have given advanced micro devices stock a general rating of buy. They strongly recommend the PE ratio as a buy and the price to book ratio as a buy as well. However, when it comes to return on investment, the analysts give the stock a rating of neutral. Let's take a look at the signals for advanced micro devices. On Wednesday, November 29, 2023, a sell signal was issued from a pivot top point. Since then, the stock has fallen by minus 4.26%. It is expected to continue falling until a new bottom pivot is found. Additionally, 
There is a sell signal from the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD. The volume of trades increased on the day with falling prices. This could be an early warning sign, indicating that the stock should be closely monitored. However, there were also some positive signals, which may have an impact on the short-term development of the stock. The short-term moving average suggests a sell signal, while the long-term average gives a buy signal. Since the short-term average is above the long-term average, there is an overall buy signal for the stock, indicating a positive forecast. If the stock continues to rise, it may face resistance at the short-term moving average, around $121.71. Conversely, if it falls, it may find support at the long-term average, approximately $111.71. A break above the short-term average would indicate a buy signal, while a break below the long-term average would indicate a sell signal. Here are some other signals that you might find interesting. Moving average convergence divergence, we have a sell signal. Pivots, we had a sell signal 4 days ago. Bollinger, we had a buy signal 27 days ago. Short-term moving average, we had a sell signal 4 days ago. Long-term moving average, we had a buy signal 24 days ago. The relation between the short and long moving averages, we had a buy signal 21 days ago. If we look at the 12-month chart, we can observe the following. Short moving average, we had a sell signal 2 days ago. Long-term moving average, we had a buy signal 22 days ago. The relation between the short and long moving averages, we had a buy signal 12 days ago. Don't forget to visit our page at stockinvest.us if you want to explore more signals. Today, let's talk about support, risk, and stop loss for advanced micro devices. When it comes to support levels, there are a couple of key points to consider. The stock currently has support just below today's level at $108.04 and $102.76. Support levels are important because they indicate a potential price floor. However, it's essential to be aware of the risk involved when a stock is testing a support level. If the support is broken, the stock may fall to the next support level. In this case, if Advanced Micro Devices breaks the support at $108.04, the next support levels to watch out for are $102.76 and $101.49. Before we dive deeper, let's assess the risk associated with trading this stock. Advanced Micro Devices has average movements during the day, and with good trading volume, the risk is considered to be medium. This means that while there is a certain level of risk involved, it's not overly high or low. It's important to keep this in mind when making trading decisions. Now, let's take a look at the stock's recent volatility. Over the last day, Advanced Micro Devices had a price range of $3.53 between its high and low, which represents a 3.03% difference. Looking at the past week, the stock has had an average daily volatility of 2.46%. This information can help you gauge the stock's potential movements and make informed decisions. Before we explore possible trading levels for advanced micro devices, let's start by discussing some important fundamental data. First, let's talk about the price to earnings ratio, also known as the PE ratio. This ratio compares a company's current share price to its per share earnings. The PE ratio for advanced micro devices is currently quite high, suggesting that the stock may be overvalued. However, it's not uncommon for technology companies or those with significant market potential to have such high ratios. Moving on to other news, the next earnings report for Q4 2023 is expected to be released on January 30, 2024. Analysts' consensus estimates for the earnings per share are at $0.770. It's crucial to keep an eye on these numbers as they can have a significant impact on stock prices. Today, we'll be looking at potential day trading levels for advanced micro devices. If the stock is on an upward trend, the first resistance level for advanced micro devices is at $118.59. If you're not already invested in the stock, it might be a good idea to wait for it to surpass this level before considering a position. However, if you already own shares, this could be a level worth considering for swing trading opportunities. On the other hand, if the stock experiences a downward movement, the first support level for advanced micro devices is at $108.04.
If this support level holds, it could present a potential entry point for traders looking for a rebound. According to multiple analyst sources, Advanced Micro Devices has received an overall buy rating. Now, let's delve into some recent insider trades. One notable insider, Sue Lisa T, conducted the five most recent trades, buying and selling a total of 159,143 shares or options in the company. Analyzing the 100 most recent insider trades, we have calculated a positive insider power ratio of 4.958. In total, insiders have purchased 1,530,175 shares and sold 1,358,070 shares within the last 100 trades. Our recommended stop loss for this stock is set at $113.39, which represents a decrease of 4.37%. This stock exhibits medium daily movements, indicating a moderate level of risk. We have identified a sell signal from a pivot top that occurred three days ago. Is Advanced Micro Devices stock a good buy? While there are several negative signals and indicators impacting its short-term development, we believe that this presents a potential buying opportunity for the long run. We anticipate that the price will increase over the next three months. Based on our analysis of volatility and recent market movements, our system suggests that the current price is overvalued. On Tuesday, December 5th, we expect advanced micro devices to open lower by $0.290 at $118.28. Before we begin, it's important to understand that trading carries a significant risk of financial loss. To ensure you make informed decisions, we strongly advise consulting a financial advisor before buying or selling any securities. Remember, StockInvest.us should not be the sole basis for your investment choices. By utilizing the information provided, you acknowledge and assume responsibility for your own investment decisions. Welcome to Stock Invest. Today, we're going to take a closer look at the current view of this stock. We value your opinion, so please share your thoughts by commenting below. Don't forget to let us know your target for this stock as well. If you enjoy our content, remember to like and subscribe to our channel. We're here to support your trading success, so have a wonderful day from all of us at Stock Invest.